as I've been meditating on death, I've realized that death is the center of the gospel message. If you're not willing to look at death, then you're not going to look at the resurrection. You're not going to understand the resurrection. You have to start at death. I think that's one of the reasons why Catholics have us looking at his crucifix, because we have to understand Jesus' death before we can understand his resurrection. As Jesus walked up to the place of the skull, he tells us, pick up your cross daily and follow me to that place of the skull. He doesn't say, pick up your prosperity gospel and get in your BMW and celebrate your life. We can't pretend that we're already in heaven, we're not. And so the way to get to heaven is to follow him to the place of the skull and to remember our death daily. I mean, really, what was Jesus thinking about as he got to the place of the skull? He wasn't thinking about his future plans. He wasn't thinking about getting to the top of the corporate ladder. He was thinking about his death. And so when we think about our death and when we allow ourselves to enter into the suffering of Jesus Christ, that allows us to find the new life that he has provided for us. There's no other way. There's no shortcut. We can't just not do what Jesus did. When Christian faith kind of rejects that, it rejects the center of the gospel message. If we don't understand that Jesus has saved us from death, then we're not going to understand the gospel message. And we have to understand what death is before we can understand what Jesus has saved us from.